In my opinion, the new Coruscant Guard gunship is a pretty good looking model. It's pretty accurate to the source material and has some very nice colors on it. But the biggest flaw is on the wing where they use stud shooters instead of bubble turrets. I'm going to be showing you guys how to fix this major flaw on the gunship and to do this, these are all of the pieces you're going to be needing. First we are going to begin by removing these horrendous stud shooters and removing these light grey plates. And the Coruscant Guard gunship we see in the Clone Wars has the white under the bubble turret, so we're going to be recreating that using these pieces. And obviously you can use just a couple 2x4 tiles in white, but unfortunately I don't have any of those, so I just decided to use a jumper plate and a 2x2 instead. After placing down all the white plates like so, you're going to be using these bar handles. You're going to be using two of these one by ones. And of course, you're going to be connecting the bubble shield on top. And already, as you can tell, this gunship is looking 10 times better than having those giant stud shooters that do nothing for the ship. But not only are we going to be improving the top side of the wing, we're also going to be improving the bottom side. So flipping the ship over, we're going to be removing this big piece right here. Next, we're going to be grabbing two of these rounded 1x2s with the holes through the studs, and then we're going to be grabbing two of the mechanical claws and putting them through the bottom of them. Next, we're going to be placing one of our round clear circle pieces with the cutout in the middle. Again, I don't know the names of these pieces. And then we're going to be placing the little build that we made earlier, and of course, placing the bubble to finish it off. As you can see, this makes the gunship look so much better, especially as a display piece, as it is more accurate to what we see in the Clone Wars. And obviously, if you use all the pieces that I showed earlier, you're going to be using it for both sides of the gunship. I'm already thinking about buying a couple more of these gunships and making these modifications, and I wish LEGO just went ahead and did this like what they did with the other gunships that they've made in the past, but it is what it is. And here is what a backside view of those bubble turrets look. Again, it just looks so much better than what LEGO did. If you guys find this helpful, make sure to like and subscribe, and I'll catch you guys in the next video.